extraordinary day for Louisiana and for St. James Parish. In fact, all of the surrounding community is going to stand to get great benefit from this particular announcement today. $9.4 billion to be invested by Formosa Petrochemical Corporation. That's a part of a really big company. When I say that, How long have you lived in Cancer Alley? Oh, man. Almost about shit all my life, man. When the first time I got there, they thought I couldn't make it, man. I was strapped up, man. And uh, they come down and say, hey, ain't no hope for him, bro. We're going to bring him in the back. They thought they, thought they were going to bring me in the graveyard. You know, and I wake up, I take up some medicine in the morning, bro. But I got to do what I got to do to live, bro. You know, and go to church every day. You know, and. And I just pray to God nobody else don't get this, this stuff what I have. I'm a strong fighter, and each one of my little cousins, they are strong fighters too. And when I came and found out, diagnosed with the cancer, it was 17 women from an area not even, we not even like 15 minutes apart. 17 women came down with cancer at the same time. That's unbelievable. And that's because of these plants. It's not because the way we live, because we didn't change life. They changed our lives for us. children don't want it, you know, they want to break that chain, but I, I, at this point, I don't see the sense in me not being here with the rest of my family in spite of all of that, you know. Being here, I don't see it as the cancer alley, but I understand where they're coming from when they call it day. Have you seen anybody get sick? My grandma, me, my dad, my papa. Asthma takes constantly. I learned how to handle it more, so it's not as bad anymore. But usually asthma attacks. You can't breathe at all, and it's hard to catch your breath. It's like almost like you're drowning. my friends on my side and then I think people go through worse things I cope with it that way good Thank you very much. 